What's up, Jones Phones? It is your girl, Unitedly Random. And uh, I have a problem, okay? And the problem is, whenever I go to the gym, after I go to the gym, I walk my little big, plump, juicy butt to the mall, and I spend my money. Okay, I spend my money. Where did it go? I spent it all, okay? So, this video, I'm gonna show you what I got from the mall today, right after this intro. It was at this moment that he knew. He fucked up. Hello. Now, we're not gonna be here for long because I didn't buy too much, but I did spend some money today. And I wanted to show you guys what I have. Okay, so a few weeks ago, I don't know if I showed you this, but I got a poking set because I've always wanted to do poke art. I made a little cactus and within two days of me having the little cactus, I lost it. So I'm going to continue to do this poke art. But I told myself, Aaliyah, don't buy more than one DIY craft at a time. I still have a puzzle back there that I need to put together. However, I've already opened this and I have made something with it. So I thought, okay, well, it doesn't, it doesn't matter too much if I go ahead and buy one more. I didn't buy two, I didn't buy three, I bought one more. Now this one more thing is actually painting. You see this? It's sunflower. So I've been lately, I've been getting a lot of things together and I'm like, I'm gonna have a recording wall in my main bedroom. So for those who don't know, or you didn't know, oh, you didn't notice it, for my birthday, I went and felted a rug. And the rug that I felted is my symbol, my your symbol that you see on most of my thumbnails on YouTube. Like it's like little, a little your in a corner, um, which count stands for which counts, but which stands for Unitedly Random. If you didn't know, I'm Unitedly Random. This place that you're at is Unitedly Random. Um, my at, you know, YouTube.com slash at. It's your your wish, your wish because I am your wish come true. You know what I mean? It's your all the way. It's your girl, Unitedly Random. You know what I mean? So that that really is like, it's really interesting that like I have, I do have like an icon. I do have something that I wanna be known for. And it's just your, it's just a U and an R with some leaves, cause I want it green. And um, yeah. And then you see on my thumbnails, a lot of it incorporates green of some way. That's on purpose, that's my theme. But anyway, I got some laundry detergent. I needed laundry detergent. However, I got some, ooh, I got some laundry. Ooh, this thing ain't even all the way closed. Ooh, ooh. It smelled good though. Mm. Got me some laundry detergent. And on top of that, I got me some earrings. They're little bears. They're little bears. And on top of that, I got me a little necklace. Now the necklace is like a little uh, butterfly on a small chain, on a big chain. So I got a little necklace, necklace. A little necklace, necklace. Yeah, I said that twice. And then I realized I don't have any bows or anything for my hair. Y'all don't know, like if y'all didn't notice, it's kind of long right now. Yeah, I woke up and it grew overnight. But anyway, I got a little bows little bows for my hair. And then I got this set because, come on, you think I'm gonna go into a store and not get some cutesy bootsy stuff? Yeah, and so these are like little star clips that I can just, I can just clip in my hair and that can be a part of my aesthetic. Yee -yee. So anyway, um, that's what I got for my hair. Right now my hair is still a little too sore to actually do anything with but sweat and be in pain. I got it done like two days ago, but like, again, I'm sweating and I'm being in pain. And then I also got these. So these, you kind of put it in your water toilet, the toilet bowl of your water, the water area of your toilet bowl. You know what I'm saying? In the States, I used to use these all the time, all the time. I like to put these in my toilets, but you put in your little water bowl thing and it helps keep your toilet clean. Right? I like them. I don't think I'll ever not use them unless if, unless I had like a dog that would drink the dog, like the toilet water. And then it's just like, <sighs> I can't use it anymore because you don't know how to act. 
On top of that, now here's something I really didn't need to buy, but I bought anyway. I went into a contact place, right? And I wanted to buy like just a little container to keep my contacts. Like just something to put my contacts in. However, when I went in there, the lady started showing me contacts. And I said, well, I know that I'm four. She said, look, here's a 4.25. Can you use work with that? I said, yes. So that's one thing that I love about being overseas. It was like this in Korea too. You just kind of walk in and tell them your number and then they just give you contact. You know, they just give you the contacts for them. Cause I was like, I'm wearing contacts right now, baby. So I got a watermelon, watermelon tonic contact lenses. So like, you guys gotta keep your eyes open to see if my eyes just start changing colors. I do have a color contact in right now. I think it makes my eyes bigger, but I don't know if you guys noticed. Let me know if you noticed, gang gang. Okay, so that is what I spent and I have to, I that hurt I have to be honest I have a problem I don't know if I started this video with saying I have a problem one of my problems is looking at myself when I'm recording and my other problem is every time I leave the gym I'm going shopping okay and I don't know if that means like you guys I got on the scale today at the gym the very first time that I was on the scale with my gym guy I was probably like 18 18, 118.6. Today I got on the scale and I was like 116.4. Okay, so it has gone down. I was trying to explain to my workout guy. I'm like, hey, it doesn't consistently go down. It goes up and down. It goes up and down. Like it might say something lower right now, but at the end of the day, I will just go back to maintaining. Okay. And he said, hey, Aaliyah, anytime that you just start binging, because legitimately, I do have binge days. Like, no doctor has said, Aaliyah, you have a binge eating disorder. But, like, legitimately, I have binge days. Days where I just eat three times in a day. I'm not hungry. I'm just gorging myself, right? I don't know what causes it. I don't think it's emotional eating, honestly. Because, like, I'm just an emotional person in general. So, it's like, is this emotional? Like, there's nothing different. Maybe I feel like lonely and so I'm eating. So then I guess it has an emotional aspect in that. But um, yeah, the reality is I still have those moments where I'm just eating, eating, eating. And there were also times where I felt like I'm doing good. I'm taking care of myself. And then I step on the scale and the scale has went up. So that was very frustrating for me to uh, realize that. Well, not even realize because like in the beginning, I said my goal wasn't weight loss. And my coach really reminded me that of that today because I was just like, I know my goal isn't weight loss, right? Like realistically, I told him, don't bring up the weight, don't bring up the weight. He called me out on it, like jump scare. He called me out on it because I was like talking about like, oh yeah, I'm working out, but I'm not really losing weight. I go up, then I go down, I go up and then I go down. And then it's just kind of like, uh, it's kind of like useless. And he was like, what you need to do is start seeing me three times a day. And I was like, you see the way my wallet is set up. I can't see you three times a week. He didn't say three times a day. He said three times a week. But I was like, the way my wallet is set up, like I would die. First of all, I don't think I'm ready for three times a week. Not financially, but not physically either. Like, I barely wanna go one time a week, okay? Like, it's something. Oh, I'm so moist. I guess I was just outside. It's hot, it's hot out in these streets. But, um, yeah, I said the way my, way, way everything's set up, baby. You lucky to get me once. I've been going to the gym and working out with this man. I wanna say almost, six times so about two within the span of two months i've been to him six times there's like two times in between where i was just like i'm sick i don't want to go and he was like okay do some exercises at home and then i didn't do the exercises at home so he said the only way you can lose weight is if you exercise some more or you eat less So yeah, which, yeah, we already know that, but like, you know what? And I think on top of that, the weight loss goal or the idea of losing weight started really kicking in because I turned 27 recently. So I'm like, ah, ah, you know, 
When am I gonna? Also, I saw some pictures of me, and them pictures were not flattering, not flattering at all. I don't know what it is about when this girl take pictures of me, but like, I I can't have her taking pictures of me. You know what I mean? There's some people that when they take pictures of you, it's just like you know. I take pictures of people, and they're like, "Oh no, I'm so ugly," and you look at the picture, and they're like. They're looking nice. It's a good picture. Like, there is this this one girl. Every time she take pictures of me, they blurry. They not nice pictures, okay? She a bad camera woman, okay? And the thing is, the thing is, I don't even often ask her to take pictures of me. I just, like, I just kind of, like, already chopped it up with, like, okay, these pictures aren't going to be really good. I just set up a camera at this point and just, you know, I brought my camera with me and I was just, like, posing a lot on my birthday with my camera. And everybody was like, oh, come take pictures with us. And I was just thinking, man, every time, every time we take pictures, my pictures don't be looking good, okay? Like, so I got to take my own pictures, you know what I'm saying? But uh, anyway, if you start to this point of the video, I want to show you a little bit of a video of me working out. So, you know, you know, your girl's actually hitting the gym. She's actually doing what she said. We might not see the change, but we're going to be the change. How da? Um, but anyway, holla, how da? Let's go ahead and I'm going to go drink some water because it's hot in this house. Let me turn on the fan. Hey, mm -hmm. turn on the fan, drink some water, and get to editing some videos. Because pretty soon, I'm going to be going back to work. Pretty soon, I'm going to be going back to work. <laughs> voila, voila. I literally, I need to like start planning my, uh, my days because I think I go back on the weekend. So, <sighs> it's so hot. I'm so uncomfortable. After I get off of this, I'm gonna just just take it all off and just sit and like sweat like a pig. But at the end of the day, much love and positive vibes. And I hope to see you guys again next time. Can y'all tell I get my little skinny? Can y'all tell? If I think it's the same. It's giving, it's giving the same. It's giving, it's giving, it's squishy. It's giving, it's giving. Oh, Bella the belly. She kind of looking, she kind of looking kind of flat. The booty is bootying though. It's not really a nice booty, but it's a booty. Okay. Some people don't have that. But Bella the belly, you know, Bella the belly is kind of getting shmong on a girl. Let me tell you, Bella the belly.